family and friends of Lindsay and Matt, welcome to their wedding ceremony this afternoon in this beautiful setting within a stone's throw of where both of these wonderful people were born and raised. From this location, you can see the surroundings of which both Lindsay and Matt have chosen to live, not very far from here in the country. The Driftless area, as we all know it, fascinating us with its natural beauty. And so it is that Lindsay and Matt present themselves to be married today, surrounded with the people they love the most. gushed about Matt from 2013 to almost every single day that we eat lunch together in our offices. When she told me that they went and looked at rings, my heart nearly exploded for them. I'm so happy you two found each other again. Matt as cute, kind, a little on the quiet side, and that he had a beard. It wasn't until a few months after they started dating that I actually met him. Any doubt or worry that I had about this new guy dating my friend immediately left my mind when I saw how happy they were together. And Lizzie's description of Matt was pretty spot on, especially his beard. Some paths are a bit longer than others, but it's not about the time spent on the journey, but experiences along the way. I know that your incredible journey is only just beginning, and I'm so thankful that I've been a part of it this far. I'm excited to continue to be your cheerleader for the rest of the years to come. things are the big things. It is never being too old to hold hands. It is remembering to say I love you at least once a day. It is at no time taking the other for granted. It is a common search for the good and the beautiful. It is not only marrying the right partner, it is being the right partner. So today, it all becomes official. You're getting married. You love each other. Matthew, I have loved you through one college graduation, four new jobs, two new cars, two houses, countless Christmases, parties, birthdays, weddings, and finally, here we are. I didn't fall in love with you. I walked into love with you with my eyes wide open, choosing to take every step along the way I do believe in fate and destiny, but I also believe we are only fated to do the things that we choose anyways. And I choose you in a hundred lifetimes, in a hundred worlds, in any version of reality, I'd find you and I'd choose you. 
Lindsay, um, as you know, I'm a man of a few words, but I have many words for how much that I love you and why I love you. Um, you're smart, loving, and have a very contagious laugh. Just <laughs> to name a few, we have a new house, Tubby and Meep, and many more fun, exciting things to look forward to in the future. You're going to make an amazing life, and Mom, and I love you, and I can't wait for it. And now, by the power invested in me, it is my honor and delight to declare you husband and wife you may now kiss. I am pleased to present our newlyweds, Mr. and Mrs. Matt and Lindsay. When I snapped my fingers, I tried to Thanos you, but the perfect balance, as all things should be, was you. And you're lovely, and you both put a smile on my face. I gained a sister. I couldn't ask for a better friend, so everyone raise your glasses to the couple who make my world always sunny, and to all you who know them, many happy years. <laughs> 